stop doing that. Oops, I don't have a light going on, it's too dark. But uh, that, that, they had to, they buried Grandpa, they burnt him and then put him in uh, the Chapel of the Chimes, uh, right? Chapel of Chimes in Oakland. Grandma, our great grandma, grandpa's mom was having these nightmares. She couldn't sleep. It was like having all these nightmares. So they actually, grandpa, Uncle Juan, they went and dug up Uncle the Juan grave. Uncle did not dig it up. Well, we were there. You were there? Yeah, you know, the family dug it up. The family dug up the grave. How'd you like to do was that? Was it just what? bones or was there any, like, no, anything just else? Just bones. bones. They, oh. you know, the body, the body deteriorates within. I don't know. Yeah. It wasn't in a, it wasn't in a, um, about like, uh, casket? Like casket? Was it a casket or anything? That's some really good tradition. That's crazy. But you know, Grandpa Juan would not be cremated. He did not believe in it. Yeah, now I understand why. At the end, he was saying, he used to always tell me, Christopher, it's all about nature. It's nature, nature, nature. And that's one of the things that... Now, he grew up with nature. He just grew up living off the land. And... Why would they burn the body, though? A lot of... The Chinese have a lot of superstitions. So there's a superstition. Okay, so Grandma and Grandpa were engaged, and they finally fell in love. And then Grandma's dad, Charles Lee, dies. And originally, they were supposed to wait three years before they can marry yeah. three years to marry and then finally after two years somebody said well he was a nice man he would have been happy with two years and he allowed him to get married <laughs> after two years but you know where the three years come from mm. they say you uh as when you're born as a baby you can't survive until you're three years old I know. by yourself Please give it they say back. you can kind of survive after three years so that you the Children have an obligation to the parents for three years. Uh, so they have to wait three years after being engaged. Anything. Well, the death of her father, she had to wait three years to. And you, after you had a baby, you can leave the house for a month. A month. Oh, well, Grandma was like that. James. <laughs> Grandma, mom, you can leave for a month. Tracy was like mom that too. Like it. Uh, Tracy's mom wouldn't let her. And then they always eat uh, pig's feet. Yep. There's certain pig's feet. That's why mom can't eat that certain, guy girl no more. <laughs> <laughs> certain uh, vinegar. It made you eat all that pig's feet because it helps your body. It cleans, um, out. It cleans out your body and helps you recuperate from having babies. Because back then you didn't have hospitals. Right? So that's where it all comes from. Survival. A lot of superstition. In the early, early, it comes from their superstition, the 1800s. I still, when I was growing up, Kaiser had just started. Mommy. Yeah. Kaiser just started. I the, before that the doctors used to come to the house. M U M M U M. I still remember they used to draw. They get that stick and they draw those cute little pictures. No. <laughs> Grandpa Charles Lee was the first dentist in Portland or something like that. Or the, so Faye's researching the families up in Portland, all the Chinese families up in there, because we're connected. Grandpa's connected with all of them through sales, through his business. That's why there's he had business in Washington, in that area.